Good. In the name of Allah, the entire merciful, the special merciful. All press due to Allah, Lord of the world. السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أعزائي طلبة الطالبات الصف السادس الابتدائي هكلمكم شوية بس بالعربي الأول كده أنا نويت النهاردة عندي حصة لستة ابتدائي أنتم متعودين عليا دايما في البث المباشر إن أنا أشتغل لكم الساعة الفيزيكس لأولى وتانية وتالتة سنة لكن النهاردة <تصفيق> هبدأ معاكم كده بداية بسيطة للصف السادس الابتدائي. Hello dear student in sixth uh, primary school with Mr. Fatih Wanimi in science subject. Hello again. Today we are speaking about um, the cell as a system. Al Khaliya ke gehes. There is student, you must know. Living organisms included, included uh, human, animals, planets, plants, and also microorganisms that we cannot see with our naked eye and eyed eye. التي لا يمكن نراها بالعين المجردة اللي هي مايكرو أورجانيزمز الكائنات الدقيقة such as bacteria all living organisms need to many vital activities uh, vital activities uh, means life activities. Um, uh, uh, vital activities. All living organisms need to do many vital activities, which means uh, life activities to survive, such as breeding. Respiration, growth, reproduction, act. Bodies of living organisms consist of a group of a system that you have studied in the previous years that you do all the previous vital activities, such as digestive system and respiratory system and humans uh, uh, in humans and animals trans uh, transportation system in a planet in planets in plants any system in a living organism's body is built up of the structures called the cell. Again, again, all system in a living in in a living organism's body is built up of tiny structures called the cell. What is the cell? The cell is the main building unit of the living organism's body that uh, carries out all its own vital activities. For that, 
cells are found only in the bodies of living organisms and they are not found in non-living things. Cells are tiny particles that cannot be seen by the naked eye, but we can need a special devices or a special device called microscope to see cells and their structures. In this lesson, we will study the structure of the plant cell and the animal cell um, cell and we are study also uh, and we are studying also cell needs and we are studying also uh, functions of cells uh, components uh, now we are finished this table time and I promise you all inshallah with next meeting with my best wishes Mr. Fatih al uh, science teacher Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh